Before the intro starts and everything, make sure to subscribe and uh, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Plus, uh, make sure to comment down below after this video if you guys do watch the full video. But if you are not, please make sure the thing uh, to make sure the main point is hit the bell down below and subscribe to the YouTube channel. And uh, make sure to go follow my Twitch uh, if you guys want to keep supporting me. What is going on, my, my poker little world? Welcome to this nice little rumor slash speculation or whatever you want to call this kind of video. But anyways, as you guys already know, Pokemon news revealed today. Apparently, yes, everyone's complaining. Well, some people are complaining like, oh, another first gen remake again. Blah, 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 blah. Yes, certain things. But there's one specifically I want to talk about. But that's going to be a little later on in the video. So hopefully, again, I'm going to re say this again, uh, pretty much the intro should have gone by a now, so make sure you guys hit that subscribe button, that would be much appreciated. Um, the more, uh, you know, subscribe, uh, basically the more support I get on these videos, the more videos I will do, and not be lazy, even though I'm still a little bit lazy regardless. But anyways, like I said, another first gen leak, remake, whatever you guys want to call it. But anyways, first things first is that, um... Yeah, uh, I've been seeing all day since, what is it, 11 a.m. I checked on my phone, I was at work, I see this whole thing blowing up, Pokemon Fire Red, well not Fire Red, Pokemon uh, First Gen Remix, and apparently it's called Pokemon Let's Play, uh, Let's Go Pikachu, sorry about that, Let's Go Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee, uh, two Switch shot, two that are going to be coming out on the Switch, uh, the Switch, uh, yes, another third gen, re another first gen remake, I don't know why I said third, if I did, I'm super sorry about that, first gen remake for the third time, but this time for the Switch, but again, I will be explaining more in this uh, video later on, so we're gonna go right into it, and we got Cerebi open right over here, because Cerebi is usually where I go check things out, because they're usually accurate about that stuff, so anyways, usually like, you know, if nothing's Pokemon on Cerebi, sometimes I'm usually like, I don't check it out. So, alright, so hopefully you guys can't see this. So it says this update may be amended throughout the day. So, no. It says Monday, let's go Pikachu. Unconfirmed rumor plus Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon Global Missions. Ultra Sun missions. We don't care about that. But we care about this thing Pokemon, let's go Pikachu. So, that is the main thing. So it says. Over the past few days, the rumors have been in full swing across the internet about the upcoming Nintendo Switch Pokemon titles. However, earlier today, a logo up went up on various message boards around the internet, which showcases the name Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu, which matches with various pieces of alleged leak information that have come up for the game. At present, it is not known if, if this is official, but we will provide full details as and when they come. So, apparently this has been going on for, what, um, almost technically a month? Because it's been going on for a couple of weeks already because apparently someone posted something on April 1st, which I, which I found out about it maybe a couple of weeks later, um, that they posted, you know, what's going to be on this new Pokemon title and stuff. So sorry if I don't got my information correctly. Yes, I did not research that much, but this is basically... Like, you know, just little details and stuff. Again, I didn't research that much, so sorry. Excuse me if I don't have all the correct knowledge over here. And then, another thing uh, this person tweeted, uh, em I think tweeted or revealed something, uh, Emily Rogers. So, it says, Emily, you said there's a Pokemon tile releasing on Switch in 2018. What should we expect from it? In July 2016, Pokemon Go launched and became a massive phenomenon. Has been downloaded more than 500 million times worldwide at the end of this year. Then by 2017, overall download number increased to over 700 million a year. This all leads to a much bigger question. What lessons should Game Freak and Nintendo learn from Pokemon Go's success? success. How could the Switch benefit from Pokemon Go's success? And how could Pokemon Go benefit from the Switch success? How, after all, it was Nintendo who released Pokemon Go Plus, a Bluetooth wearable device developed by Nintendo's platform technology division 
that allows players to enjoy uh, the game without looking at their smartphone. Would Nintendo ever dare to create more Pokemon Go accessories like that? Possibly even for the Switch? Uh, Joe Madden, the creator, Cerebi, okay, forget about that. But anyways, regardless, Pokemon Go, you guys already know, it was a hit about almost, what is it, almost two years since that game came out. It was a hit. First month, everybody was downloading, 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 even though I don't play it that much. Regardless, I don't play it that much. I cut down on it a lot. So the last, I only play like, what, once in a blue moon for like, what, 10 minutes? Every, like, probably like three months. But regardless... Pokemon Go is a hit, Switch is a hit, so they might be doing something compatible with both things. So, since they're both, since they both have a hit, uh, since they both, like, you know, are big sales and stuff, so they might be, you know, collaborating, well, not collaborating, and doing something with, relatable with both, so that would be a good thing. But, the main thing, if you guys don't know, yes, I'm gonna be going back, which... Probably, I don't know, I only watched like maybe like two videos of people's like rumors and stuff, but Here's is one thing. I hopefully I play this clip when I edit When I edit it, now, I'm gonna take off this window capture right now because I'm on OBS I'm, I don't right now tear I know I'm saying why well, I'm recording this on but and hopefully I have some music in the background and but Hopefully I play this little video clip so hopefully Video clip should be playing right now and So Mikey, are you pumped to meet some alone Pokemon? Of course. That's right. I wanna hurry up and meet some too. We we're living in the Alola region now. That's beautiful. The the beautiful islands everyone wants to visit. Pretty much. I'm sure the Pokemon living in a place like this must be friendly, right? I guess. Was that the doorbell? I don't know, maybe it was, it wasn't, I don't know, know man. That's gotta be Professor Kyuki. I don't even know how to say his name. I guess that's Kyuki, Kyuki? I don't know. Forgive me. <laughs> Why don't you let him in, Mikey? What happened, man? Okay, he just lets himself in. That's cool, too. That's fine. It's fine with me. Just... Hey there, Mikey. The name is Kyuki. Good to meet you, cousin. Is he? Is he my cousin? You gotta be tired after a long trip all the way out here to Lola. You feeling angelic? I don't think so, man. We should have took a long, <clears throat> a long way from Kanto out here in Lola. I guess. Uh, it's still daytime out here. Yeah. What's a Kyuki? We just arrived yesterday. Hey there, Mom. I just let myself in. Oh. Wait. Hey there. Okay. And call me Kiki, would you? Welcome to Lola. Of course, I still remember seeing you battle in the Enigo gym. The leaders back in Kento. Oh, snap. Flashback! Oh, this is... I've been in love with the alone Pokemon ever since, so I decided... Yeah, I decided... Finally decided to come here for myself. Okay. Ha, I was supposed to be visiting there to re research Kento Pokemon moves and all. I thought I knew a thing or two about battling, but those Kanto gym leaders proved me wrong. Oh, oh no, Hugh! I just, ah. Uh, everybody just barges in the, the door. Why not? This is definitely your house to live in. A disaster, a total disaster. What's wrong, Hugh? Oh, Auntie, I'm s Hi, sorry. I'll explain later, but, but my guest is coming with you right now. If you don't hurry, the ship's gonna leave. Ship? What? Ship? The ship? You know, Lily, Kanto is a long way from here. Try not to let the jet lag hit you too hard. We need to well. She said she'd be too sad to watch you go, so she wouldn't even come out with me. I know it's a lot to ask, but favor her this time, would you? She just tell me 
to let you know the loss in the lab is yours to use indefinitely. So you can come back and stay whenever you like, Lily. You didn't tell us. Who? I'm sorry. But I decided to go. I have to go to Kento. Tell my mother get better. But more than that, to help myself get stronger. Of course, I'm sad to leave Al Alola. But the thought of going to Kento also fills my heart with excitement. I'm going to become a real trainer and meet all of the kinds of wonderful Pokemon. I'm going to travel all around Kanto, just like we did here on Alola uh, for your island challenge. No matter what happens in my journey, I'm going to be okay. Because of the smiles that you share with me, you and Mikey, and everyone here. Thank you all so much. And that's why someday I'll be come back to Alola again. But, but, but I haven't got to say any of the things I wanted to say to you. It's alright. I'm going to send you a letter. A really, really long one. You better wait. I will. And please take this. What do I get? <laughs> what do I get? Mikey, it may look a little worn, but that is because this is my most treasured belonging one. Poke doll. Okay, I guess. Then I suppose this is a goodbye. Okay. I guess she sails off. This is a sad, sad, sad. I'm gonna cry. I'm gonna cry over here, dude. Okay, I'm back one more time. So this is the last thing right before I switch back. Basically, I found this while I was editing my video. So I was trying to find some stuff. So I found this while editing my video. So this will be pretty much, this is gonna be three things that apparently is found. So uh, I'll leave the link in the description. So this is by uh, Kuro Otaku Senpai. Um, well, I just randomly found this website, so I'll link the, that link down in the description below. So, Sun, Pokemon Sun and Moon discontinued Professor Kuki. Alright, so it says, Welcome back. Professor Kuki greeted the five as the five walked in and sat down in the seats. Uh, what are we going to learn today? The sun asked for Kuki as Kuki began to write something on the whiteboard. Today we will finish. Uh, we'll be lear uh, learning about Pokemon Village from Tsukiki to five. Firstly, there are hundreds of Pokemon Village, which some are specific to some Pokemon, while uh, there are some which a lot of Pokemon share. From Tsukiki to the five has sent to Pokemon Wild Charmander and Cyndaquil. Sun as a wide uh, a weed. Sorry if I can't English correctly. At the site of two fire types Pokemon. Indeed, these two Pokemon can be found in the Kanto region. However, Cyndaquil was a lot more rare. Professor Kiki laughed. Wait, you have been to Kanto? Sun and Kiki? He did. Moon cheered. He told us about how he challenged us in the lead. How cheered. Ha uh, ha. I'll retell you the story later on. For now, and let's focus on, so po on Pokemon abilities. Kiki told him. Now, Cyndaquil and Charmander shared the same ability, that being Blaze. Professor Kiki told the five, Hal sent out Litten. Kiki sent, uh, Kiki told Hal, Hal threw his Pokeball, releasing Blue Energy, which the form Litten. Your Litten also adds Blaze. Professor Kiki told him as he began to pat Litten, just what does Blaze do? Blah, blah, blah. Let's keep going, let's keep going. This is useless dialogue. Let me see, let me get to that important part. Hold on. Uh, this is, sorry about that, <laughs> um, so, let me not read all this, let me get to the important part, give me one second, alright, um, so, let me see, uh, okay, so, alright, so he told the story, 
Uh, Kiki is having a It all started a couple years back. Kiki told the five cancel the video plays on the same Alright, to the psychic. About three years later, I took on the lead challenge. I defeated all the gym leaders, but the eighth gym was shut down, so I decided I was ready for the lead. I defeated the psychic elite four member Will. Then I defeated poison type elite member Koga. Next up was a difficult battle, but I beat down the fighting elite four member Bruno. Then with the next fighting hard, I but I managed just fine. I beat the final elite member, elite four member, the dark trainer Karen. Kuki explained as he looked out the window, but then when I took on the champion, he obliterated me. Kuki laughed. The Dragon Master lands. Man, he was really something. Kuki finished the story. Uh, let me see. Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. These are all basically. Okay, so, uh, so, time to finish the Dragon Master. He lost, so I lost. Kuki side. Well, Kuki, that was in the degree battle. Lance Kuki up. Uh, all right. When I got uh, stronger, I would defeat you, Lance. Kiki, so Lance. So, so here's another thing. Before I switch back, basically, again, this is after I recorded. Like I'm editing. I'm still editing my video. So I just found this. So here's another speculation. We might see. We might. Sorry about that. We might see. Hopefully in Pokemon, again, Pokemon, uh, let's go Pikachu and let's go Eevee. We might see the dialogue between those two. So imagine if that happened. This will probably be, be before Red goes to, um, let me see. No, this pro what, what's his name? Gold or something? It will probably be before maybe Gold comes into place. So probably before Gold comes into place, uh, Professor Kuki ver uh, versus him, or it might be after, but let's see. Anyways, back onto the video. I'm so sorry, I just had to fill that in. And uh, all that good jazz, so thank you guys so much. So, anyways, back to the video. So sorry about that. Right now, I should be back right now. So, yeah. Anyways, if you guys saw that clip, um, what is it? Lily, I think, was going to, uh, at the end of Sun, of Sun and Moon, excuse me, I don't know why I said Sun, Sun and Moon, she was going to Kanto. Professor Kyuki, I don't know however you pronounce him. He was in Kanto. Maybe here is my opinion. Yes, they're going to go back to first gen, but they might add Professor Kyuki because they are apparently going to add the nice little... They're not going to add the HM, so that means it's going to be something that Alolan, uh, in the Alolan regions did. So that means Professor Kyuki might go they we might see him there so that's the thing it might be a add-on maybe instead like you know they didn't full surely fully they didn't fully show excuse me my wording is terrible right now i don't care i'm uh, i'm not gonna edit this i'm so sorry but anyways they might add professor kyuki however you pronounce this flipping name into pokemon let's go pikachu and let's go eevee that's a that's a hint right there because he said that he went to the uh, he went back he went to Kanto and he first went there and then he went to the Alola region and plus they're using the same mechanics so we might see Professor Kuki after the main game so after the main game the events might happen with Professor Kuki maybe Samson Oak might be there also well, is his name Samson Oak that both Oaks might meet up. Lily might be there. Whoever knows, but regardless, that probably is gonna go. Maybe that's gonna affect the timeline somehow. So Professor Kuki might be there. Lily might be there. They might be going back for a reason. So I don't know if anyone else discussed this. Um, but regardless, um, yeah. So hopefully, uh, I showed I, I showed the video, so that should add up to at least ten minutes. I'm not even worried about the time. But regardless. Hopefully you guys join, uh, enjoyed this video. If you guys want to, make sure to leave a like on this video uh, if you guys enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, uh, I know um, I really usually don't do these types of videos and I suck at it. Yes, I know I suck at it. But anyways, um, hopefully you guys enjoyed it. And uh, yeah, I will see you guys in the next episode of something or a highlight. Maybe I might upload. Honestly, I barely upload anymore. I just got... 
like lost motivation again i don't know why i'm just lots of motivation busy etc but anyways i will see you guys in the next episode this has been mikey aka don't poke your eyes out make sure not to poke your eyes out i don't even know what i'm saying but anyways make sure not to poke your eyes out and i'll see you guys in the next video or streaming if you guys are not following me on twitch aka twitch.tv anyways i will see you guys next time Bye -bye.